Welcome problem solving fans to another problem of the day and this one is all about car park charges. Mr Singh parks his car. Here are the charges. So at the White Rose car park the first hour is £2.50 and every additional 30 minutes or less is £1.80. So what that or less means is even if you only spend 15 minutes it does not mean that you can only pay half the amount of money. So even if you only spend 15 minutes, you've still got to pay £1.80. Now that will come into play later on. So Mr Singh arrives at 10.45am and he leaves at 2.30pm. How much did he pay to park? Well, the first thing we need to do is figure out how long he's actually been there. So if he gets there at 10.45, the first hour will take him to 11.45. The second hour will take him to 12.45. The third hour will take him to 1.45 p.m. And the fourth hour would take him to 2.45 p.m. But this means we've gone over the 2.30 p.m. that he said that he left at. So what we need to do is figure out how much he's actually going to pay. So in the first hour from 10.45 to 11.45, he pays £2.50. In the second hour, from 11.45 till 12.45, he pays £1.80, but two lots of that. Because that £1.80 is for 30 minutes. And obviously we're doing a second hour, so if we double that 30 minutes to get 60 minutes, we would double the £1.80. Well, double £1.80, if you can't do it in your head, let's do a quick column method. So £1.80 times 2. Two nothings and nothing. Two eights, sixteen. Put the six in, carry the one. Two ones are two, plus the one is three. So double one pound eighty is three pound sixty. So every additional complete hour after the first hour is three pound sixty. So from eleven forty five to twelve forty five, that's three pound sixty. From twelve forty five to one forty five, that's another complete hour. So that's three pound sixty. And from 1.45 to 2.45, even though he is not doing a full hour, he is actually going to do another 45 minutes. So he will still have to pay the extra £3.60. So all we need to do now is add these up. So, 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 is 0. 6, 6 and 6 is 18. Plus 5 is 23. Put the 3 in, carry the 2. 3 plus 3 plus 3 is 9. Plus 2 is 11. Plus another 2 is 13. So, the total cost he's got to pay is £13.30. Now, that does mean that he's actually paid up to 2.45 and he is going to leave at 2.30 so there would be an extra 15 minutes left on his uh, ticket but as it says here every additional 30 minutes or less so even though he doesn't use that last full half hour and uses 15 minutes of it he's still got to pay that extra £1.80 so this £30.30 is the price he's got to pay